Trade Confident family. How is everyone doing today? My name is Jake, and I'm here to bring you your daily crypto insight. Yesterday's Bitcoin candle was a drastic drop in the market. We're seeing a little bit of a bounce off of support at what appears to be $65,000. While this may be temporary relief, unfortunately, we are still expecting larger moves down in the market. Now, I detailed part of why this was in yesterday's Bitcoin video. We're going to go over it a little bit again and provide some new data as to why this drop could continue. Speaking of which, if we head to the tradeconfident.io webpage, heads up, 169 wins, zero losses in our membership trades, you're going to want to watch our future forecast video posted yesterday. Prepare for a $20,000 Bitcoin crash. Here's the data. In today's analysis, Travis will be showing you data that says we are most likely going to head down a lot further. I've said this before, but there is no reason for price to break back above the all-time high right now. We're going to show you multiple chart patterns that point to Bitcoin dropping thousands more here on multiple time frames. Now, long term, we are uber bullish. But before you sell or buy anything, watch this analysis for wisdom. Now, I think it is very important to reiterate trade confident, even if there is a larger drop about to happen in Bitcoin, we're overall bullish. I'm going to talk to you about what our plans are for the market later on in this video. So stay tuned. First up. Pretty bullish reading here from the Bitcoin Emotional Index. An anxious reading will typically result in moves up. Anxious and fearful tends to be very bullish. So this could actually indicate some larger moves up before a drop in the market happens. Very exciting to see. Next up, I want to talk to you about the Bitcoin whale smart money metric. Where whale money goes, the price is likely to go to and we're seeing long trade sentiment for whales. This is very exciting. This means whales could be buying up soon. But keep in mind, it's not until we see a metric value of around 600 or 800 that really strong bullish sentiment comes into play. This shows what whales are likely to do soon. Let's talk about what whales are doing today with the Bitcoin whale money flow relative to price chart. Now, as of today, with a tick up, whales have actually began selling. Whale money is moving out of the market and this is something we need to be very careful of because once again, where whale money goes, the price is likely to go too. So this is looking bearish over the next couple of days. Lastly, I wanna to talk to you about the Bitcoin trade signals chart. As the price drops, we're gonna be looking for another buy signal. As soon as this posts, most often, this will be a very good opportunity to buy back into the market just as the signal calls. So buy signal, especially when the rest of the metrics are looking bullish, could show a great buy opportunity for Bitcoin. Now, members get access to the Bitcoin metrics as well as metrics across all 20 coins on our website. If you are a member, watch the future forecast if you haven't already and check out our trade setups page for some possible trade opportunities. If you're not a member, you're going to want to snag a membership so you can do those same things. And if you want to join us, links are in the description down below. Go ahead and scroll down, click more. Membership is the first link. Click that and it's going to bring you to our membership page. Full access, $59 a month is what you're looking for, but hurry because price increases up to $65 a month are coming April 20th. You do not want to miss out on this discounted price. If you purchase now, you will stay at this lower price. Membership is going to include everything I just showed you and more. Go ahead and click subscribe now, follow the prompts, and we're so excited to trade with you soon. Time for the news, guys. The U.S. government is preparing to sell 30,000 Silk Road Bitcoin on-chain data shows. This is crazy and something we need to pay very close attention to as Bitcoin traders. Today, the U.S. government sent a transaction that appears to indicate it may be on the verge of liquidating the remaining Bitcoin it confiscated from the online marketplace Silk Road. According to on-chain data, a 0.001 Bitcoin test transaction, part of a larger stash of approximately 30,174 Bitcoin worth $2 billion, linked to the infamous Silk Road marketplace or moved by the U.S. government. Coinbase, the largest cryptocurrency exchange in the United States, received the transaction from the Silk Road-related funds. Arkham Intelligence first identified the origins of where the Bitcoin was coming from and the coin's destination of Coinbase. It appears the purpose of this transaction is to sell the coins as it has previously done in the past. Guys, 
you do not move your cryptocurrency from a cold storage wallet to an exchange to buy crypto. The US government appears to be about to sell a huge amount of Bitcoin. Last March, the US government sold off 10,000 Bitcoin related to Silk Road, selling just 9,861 Bitcoin worth 216 million. Let me reiterate what we're working with today. Up here, we're going to be selling 30,174 Bitcoin worth $2 billion, much larger amount. Let's talk about real quick what happened last time Bitcoin saw this major sell. The official sell date was March 14th, 2023. As we can see, we're on the four hour time frame trading Bitcoin USD on the index. From the top, we began selling right at this point and we dropped at the absolute bottom the following day, March 15th, we had dropped 7.89%. This is a major, major move down for Bitcoin, at a, especially at that time. While Bitcoin wasn't worth nearly as much as it is now, very near its previous all-time highs, this was at $26,000. So the sale was not as much, over 200 million for sure, but not near the $3 billion mark we're at now. So imagine we're selling over three times the amount of Bitcoin, over 30,000 versus nearly 10,000 Bitcoin for a much higher value. This has very strong potential to knock the price of Bitcoin down much further than it previously had. Now, some things to think about, there's a much higher supply of Bitcoin, but this again is balanced by literally three times the amount of Bitcoin being sold. So we need to be careful. But overall, while we can't know for sure exactly how far down Bitcoin could drop, we do need to pay attention and keep in mind the fact that with the US government planning to sell Bitcoin, a drop is very likely incoming. Now, something I wanna bring up as well, right here, this orange line, you're seeing the 21 EMA, the exponential moving average. And what you're gonna notice is Bitcoin is using this as a structure support quite a bit until it sees a candle that drops below it. At that point, it begins trending downwards, as you can see in this area here. Up here, you saw the candle crash below. We pumped back above, but crashed below it again. At this point, we are seeing a candle seriously stay under. And if we see a candle open and close below the 21 EMA, this is going to be bearish and most often will result in downwards trends as well. So that's point number two for bearish sentiment for Bitcoin, despite today's bullish candle. Point number three, Whale money is moving out of the market and where whale money goes, the price is likely to go too. So we should expect moves down and coming for Bitcoin on both the one day and check this out, the one week time frame. Price versus whale money flow is actually very high. Whale money is trending out of the market despite the fact that the price has been trending upwards during the same period of time. Major bearish divergence. Most often this will result in price moves down even aside from the fact that whale money itself is moving out as we see a bearish candle, I think we need to be paying close attention to structure support. One week time frame is gonna be very important to pay attention to throughout the next few weeks as we lead into the halving event. If we see price versus whale money flow low, trades in favor low with a buy signal, get ready on the weekly time frame. This is extremely bullish, even more than it would be on the daily. And this, this combination, Price versus well money flow low, trades in favor low with a buy signal is typically what we're looking for to see moves up. On the one day time frame, I'm looking for that combination of signals to play out around the $62,250 mark or as low as $58,500. Now here at Trade Confident, I know this is kind of a scary number, but we aren't scared, we're not worried. And rather than panic sell in anticipation of massive crashes down, and even if we do get a massive crash down, Trade Confident is actually looking to dollar cost average into the market as the dips happen. We're buying these dips, guys, That's easy as that. Now, I'm not telling you what you should or shouldn't do with your money. This is not financial advice. I just wanna let you know what we here at Trade Confident are doing. Our goal is to maximize our supply of Bitcoin and other cryptocurrencies in anticipation of the halving event and subsequent major blast offs in the bull market. So more than anything, this is just a fantastic buy opportunity to buy up the liquidity that the US government is creating. Now I wanna go over some alerts here. 
between April 1st and today, we've gotten a lot of different signals. On the four hour here, we got a Bitcoin four hour buy signal. We got multiple four hour watch for pump scenarios. Let's actually go over to the four hour for Bitcoin so you can see what I'm talking about. Buy signals will typically result in moves up. Price versus wall money flow low, trades in favor low. Buy signal, we are seeing that move up. Let me adjust this so it's easier to see. Very good call from these indicators. I was able to see that happen with these alerts. In fact, I wasn't even, I was editing videos when this played out, guys. I didn't see this on the chart, but these alerts let me know it was playing out. I'm not particularly looking on the lower time frames. I have alerts set for the one day and the higher one week time frames as well. Those are the ones I'm more concerned with. But if you're a day to day trader, this on the four hour time frame could be great for you. Over here, we've gotten some Doge and Ethereum signals. I got another Bitcoin buy signal. Lots of lots of signals we need to pay attention to. I'll be talking about the Doge and Ethereum signals a little bit later. I promised you guys I would, but for today, or at least this video, we're focusing on Bitcoin. I wanna show you real quick how to set those alerts for yourself. You're gonna to go to this clock. You're going to click the plus sign right here, create alert, and then I'm using trades in favor here. We're going to look for a watch for pump. Actually, I'm sorry. First, the very first step, you want to set it to the time frame you're actually watching. Currently, let's set one for the one week. I think this is going to be important. One week time frame. I'm going to set it to the trades in favor, watch for pump, once per bar close, and we're going to name it. Bitcoin one week, watch for pump, click create. I'm gonna make another one. This one is gonna be the TC top and bottom finder. We're just gonna stick with a buy signal once per bar close and name it. Bitcoin one week buy, click create, and we're gonna do it one more time. Switch it to the TC top and bottom finder. This time it's gonna be a strong buy once per bar close and name it. Bitcoin one week strong buy, go and click create. These three alerts are gonna let me know as soon as we get the bullish trifecta, as soon as we see trades in favor within the long trade zone as soon as we see a buy signal at that time whale money should be low as well and all three of these combined to be extremely bullish as we can see back here this is how we're calling insane moves even when we're not even at our computers to make trades if you get those alerts be ready for massive moves up in the market. Now, these indicators have helped us earn 169 wins, zero losses in our membership trades. Absolutely absurd. And right now, I can help you get them for up to $550 off. Check this out. All right, guys, links are in the description down below. Go ahead and scroll down, click more. Indicators are the second link. Click that. And it's going to bring you to our Pro Indicator page. Pro Indicator Pack is what you're looking for. Members, you get $150 off. It's actually much cheaper to purchase with a membership than it is without one. Go ahead and access the coupon code at that link. Click Pro Indicator Pack. Scroll down and click I want this. Throw in that membership code. Fill in your information. Click Pay. And it's going to offer you the TC Top and Bottom Finder for $400 off, giving you that full $550 discount. Go ahead and click Add to Cart. Follow the prompts. And we're so excited to trade with you soon. And with that, I just want to say thank you so much for watching. Remember, trade safe, trade confident, and I will see you in that future forecast video. Don't miss it.